California is still locked in an epic drought. Our rivers and streams are withering. Our lakes and reservoirs are being systematically drained. Last week I flew over New Melones, the state's fourth largest reservoir, and recorded its sorry condition. This week, uh, the aerial flight is over Shasta and Trinity Lakes, the first and third largest reservoirs. This trip involved a quick flight north to Redding, California. There we landed at Benton Field, put the GoPro cameras on, and headed north a short hop to the big lake, Shasta. The goal was to get this done early before turbulence kicked our butts. That's the Sundial Bridge on the Sacramento River that you see on the right. Lake Shasta was built in 1948. It's the state's largest storage reservoir, and it truly is huge. Uh, it essentially impounds four major rivers, the Pitt River, Squaw Creek, McLeod River, and Sacramento River. We flew over these four major arms of the reservoir, roughly east to west. Now when full to capacity, the Big Lake holds an astonishing 4.5 million acre feet. Now that's enough to fill 55 million swimming pools. And where does the lake set today? A paltry 1.1 million acre feet, or about 25% of capacity. Now to put this in context, only once in its history has the lake been this low? That was in August of 1977 when it dropped to just 0.6 million acre feet. 1976 and 77 were the years of our previous worst drought. And that was 37 years ago. Next up was a short 12 minute ride over the hill to Trinity Reservoir. Okay, now we're, um, we're between uh, Shasta and Trinity. We're going over a ridge line here. We're at 5,000 and then Trinity Lake's gonna be uh, right in front of us in that big bowl. Trinity Reservoir was built in 1961, and it was filled in 1963. While it's the third largest reservoir in the state, it's still very huge, holding 2.45 million acre feet when it's filled to capacity. And that would be enough to fill 29 million swimming pools. Right now, today, it's in about the same status and situation as Shasta, holding about 25% of its capacity and dropping daily. And like Lake Shasta, it's been 37 years since Trinity Lake was as low as it is today. That was in October of 1977. Again, the second year of our previous worst drought. Anyway, may the rains, and especially the abundant snowpack upon which these two reservoirs depend, return soon. Thanks for watching. You can browse my other videos at Sting Flight and subscribe. It's free.